Hello everyone, it's Jeanette Silhouette here with you today. Um, I just wanted to get on here and wish everyone a very happy Valentine's Day. I know it's not till tomorrow, but um, but that's okay. Um, I've been playing with makeup today, so I thought this would be the perfect time to uh, to get on a vlog since I have some 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 stuff on. This is definitely more of a dramatic look for me. Um, it would be an evening look for me. Um, I went to uh, did a little shopping yesterday and I picked up an eyeliner that I'd like to share with you. I think some of you have even talked about it. But listen, the reason why I decided to, to pick it up and check it out is because of this. Can you see that right there? Yeah, that's why. Um, it The package has something that has spilt, like, some product on it. So they probably were just getting rid of it. Um, so I bought it for $5. It's normally... 847 at Walmart. I went over to the to the to the L'Oreal section to, to see if this was something that was discontinued or to see if they still had a line of this product there. Well, let there be light. Um and they did. And what's funny about it is that they had black, very black, deepest black, black black. Yeah. So what I'm saying is is that What's really cool about it is the one that was for five dollars that they were trying to get rid of because some sort of nail polish or something spilled on it is bronze because I can't wear black you guys it would be so you can you see how intense the bronze is yeah I mean uh, for my coloring black would just make me look like I'm trying to be goth not, not that there's anything wrong with that I'm just saying, I, I, you know, uh, I need browns, uh, and so even this brown is kind of dark, but I kind of like it. Like I said, I've been playing today, I've been playing with my look, with my makeup. I've been trying to do tips and stuff that you guys have been doing, and I've been playing around. Um, what I really played around with a lot <laughs> um, was my eyebrows. I, I'm always trying to get them even. I know that they're not going to be perfectly the same, but one does arch way up higher than the other. Not right now. It doesn't. And in my other vlogs, I've, you know, somewhat corrected that. I usually have to cut it, cut one side down a little bit to make it more, <coughs> pardon me, look more like the other side. Um, but I, I tried to make them a little thicker today. And... When I was out and about yesterday, I tried desperately to find that e.l.f. clear mascara um, or eyebrow gel or whatever. I couldn't find anything like that. So I had an old spoolie that I kept, um, and I washed it out really good. And I'm sure that I'm not the first person to do this, but I actually used um, just some hair gel. And just sort of kind of defined and tried to make them bigger. And I listen, I had to play for a long time because I'm not used to using a product such as a gel in my eyebrows. I do use an eyebrow pencil, but I don't even always use one of those. It just depends. You know what I'm saying? I mean, if I'm just running to the store, because I mean, I'm in such a rural area, you guys. If I if I go to town, I'll. I'll and now that I'm getting older, in all honesty. I'm paying more attention to to detailing myself a little a little more. So, uh, so I wanted to mention that, and it did it. it I I like it. I was able to kind of shape and um. Uh, there's this. I'm not sure that I like the color of my eyebrow pencil, but I'm evolving. I'm just saying. I'm just putting that out there. Where I am today is not where I'm going to be a year from now. And, of course, I believe I'll be in a better place. Um, 
both emotionally um, and both, I mean, you know what I'm saying? I mean, am I going to be one of those people that mentions that I'm by myself on Valentine's Day? Yes. Am I broken hearted over it? You know what? I'm going to tell you what. In all honesty, I, I'm not broken hearted about it. I am, I don't like it, but becoming involved on YouTube and watching your vlogs and commenting and some of the sweet kind comments that you that you give back and whatnot I don't have a whole lot of people watching me right now but what little bit I have going on has meant the world to me when you're by yourself and you have to take care of everything yourself and and just you know blah 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 right um, I'm just trying to to make a point of how much it means and has meant to me to feel like you guys are sort of kind of including me into this community right now it feels really good and so this Valentine's Day um, I feel like I have you guys I feel like I have friends a lot of the friends that I've had that live in this area, you know, they've they've moved on. You know, they're they're no longer here. Um, <laughs> I mean, people come and people go, and that's sort of kind of, you know, where I'm at right now. In all honesty, um, just had to check the time because I know I don't have a lot. I, I think I have 15 minutes. You guys have been saying, yeah, you got 15. Okay, so we're at seven minutes almost, but I, again, I wanted to say thank you. I wanted to say happy Valentine's Day to everyone, and um, thanks for inspiring me to play some more with my, with my look and evolve, and I'm, I'm, I'm smiling because of you guys. I really am, so I appreciate it. Um, I would also like to say one more thing. Um, I have on today one of those three-way ponchos. I'm not going to get up and model it for you right now because I want to do a separate vlog about that. Um, just because I don't have the full look on, I there's I don't have the pants on, and I, and I knew that if I kept messing around, I messed around with makeup so long today that I thought. Um, I'm never gonna vlog <laughs> while it's still light out where I, you know, um, you know where I have some decent lighting to, uh, you know, to vlog with. So um, I I will though I'll complete the look and I will show it to you. I will say one thing right now. I have this. I have I have pulled up that cowl neck. I guess is the term for it, and I put it. Um, up around my neck and I've made a turtleneck out of it I have pinned it with a pin that will not snag okay and it's not a safety pin one of those pins that uses one of these little attachment backings you know everybody's got one um, now be careful because sometimes these aren't very secure but the one that I have in uh, is is very secure it's I, it's I just pinned it in the back to hold it up so it's like a turtleneck and again with one of those pins that's you know that's one of these there's probably a name for it and I don't know just make sure it's really sharp and take your time putting it in um, it, you know it, because you just you just don't want to snag the material so just be careful um, it's funny because you it, it's gotten darker since I've been talking just in the last few minutes and I feel like the lighting has totally changed. I feel like I've in the year 2000. Let me see if I can turn this off. Well, I'm not sure that. The, <laughs> I feel like I'm green. I'm one of the monsters. I'm one of the cousins or something. I don't think they had any cousins. But anyways, I don't know. Maybe, maybe it's better. Let's see. Let's see what we can do. Well, that's a little better. It's snowing like crazy here right now. 
I uh, don't, and the wind's blowing like crazy right now, and it's really cold, and yesterday when I was out and about, the wind chill was 17 below. I know that sounds warm to some of you guys, but I have to be honest, I did not dress for it, and I preach about dressing for the weather. <clears throat> Pardon me. So, um, yeah, uh, I was sorry that I didn't dress for it yesterday. I was freezing. Oh, my goodness. Well, anyways, I will vlog about the three-way poncho and what I think about it. I do like it. I've not. Uh, this is the first thing that I did to play around with that was to make a turtleneck out of it. Now, the thing is, is that I love turtlenecks, but when I buy a turtleneck, I'm here to tell you right now, I st will stretch the crap out of it until I hear snap, crackle, pop if I have to. I mean, because, you know, you stretch it out and you think, okay, that's good. Yeah, it's not too tight. It's not bothering me. And then it just could get tighter, tighter, tighter. And then I'm, I find myself constantly pulling and stretching on it, which is just stupid because, well, it's not stupid. It's just that I, my point is, is that with this look that I've done making it into a turtleneck, which I'm sure I'm not the first person to think of that, but um, it, I can control how tight it is. I'm in control of how tight it is and I really like that so let's see is there anything else I think that a, a girlfriend gave me this necklace I believe it was from Avon I got it for Christmas like probably five or six years ago it has matching earrings well, you probably can't see them too good but so um yeah. Happy Valentine's Day. Thanks for your friendships. And thanks for being so kind to me. I appreciate it so much. Oh, my goodness. Hey, um, I found a tagline that I would like to say. Um, don't know if I'll use it every time, but, and maybe some other time I'll explain why it means so much to me and where I actually heard it from when I was a little girl actually and the tagline is it takes all kinds of people to make a world so first tagline it takes all kinds of people to make a world you be and make sure that you are a part of it thanks for watching guys <laughs>